Good morning. Good morning. My name is Sylvia Smith of Incline Training Consultants Limited. I was clean my windscreen. I'm here again. I hope I'm here regularly to chat with you. Let you know what's going on. I'm on my way to the gym. I promised that I would um, get a work a workout uh, in this morning. Um, it's unlikely that I'll be able to do one tomorrow, but I may be able to to do one early tomorrow. But I wanted to get a couple in before carnival party time. Um, but today, sadly, I will be attending a funeral, and. Um, I definitely wanted to blow off some of the cobwebs uh, before, before I attend that um, sad occasion end. And um, it does mean that here in England we have Monday off and we essentially celebrate Carnival this weekend. This is Notting Hill Carnival. But there are carnivals in Boston, I understand. There's also one in Leeds, which is another part of like, the UK. Um, I am not entirely sure where the others may be taking place in the rest of the world. But, um, yeah, and from what I can gather, the weather's not going to be blistering. Certainly what the forecasts are saying so far. It's not going to be blistering here. Um, and that's kind of interesting because... Because we have some dreadful things happening in Hawaii. Um, we have some earthquakes going on in the Caribbean region. Trinidad in particular. So, you know, as I was saying to my, my dear friend, um, Carol, yesterday, she lives in my, um, in Florida, you know, the, the, the whole weather system is just uh, concerning, particularly at this time of the year. Um, we've had monsoons in, in um, India, uh, and, you know, these extremes of weather are really uh, destroying Fragile, um, fragile, can, fragile communities, fragile economies. Um, yeah, it's not great. So, it's a long weekend this weekend in terms of uh, time. What thoughts have I been having? What reflections have I been having? Well, you know, yesterday I went to Shropshire. Uh, and spent quite a lot of time, well, more or less the whole day with, with a colleague, social worker. Um, we were just discussing and sharing some of the, some of the concerns we have about, you know, what's going on um, in our profession and what's going on in the organisation that, that we both work for and um, how you know, because of the sort of current climate, um, how basic we are all operating at, um, sort of anxiety driven, um, almost to a point where, you know, awful things are happening and um, our instant concerns are for our own well-being and safety. And, and, and concern about whether we dot the I's and cross the T's. And it just feels a bit as though that concern is a bit mis not, not irrelevant, but misplaced. Because we are constantly operating in a kind of fear. Not good. Not good at all. Anyway, I'm at the gym. I'm going to 
work it all off, shake off those cobwebs, and uh, I'll be back with you when I'm done. Yeah, just finished in the gym, um, in there for about an hour, some gentle cardio, um, the ellipticus, what else did I do, the bike, and the rowing, uh, the rower, which I really like actually because it's kind of like an all round body exercise. Um, so yeah, had a good session, uh, did some stretching, did a couple of uh, yoga moves to strengthen the shoulders. Uh, when I get home, I think I'll do a few, uh, a bit of free weights, because Adrian has some weights at home. I think I need to do some of my, uh, work on my arms a bit. And that's that! <coughs> Went very well. <clears throat> now on my way home to freshen up, um, have a little brekkie. I'm gonna have some. I had some porridge yesterday while I was traveling. It was really nice. So I'm gonna have some back of that today at home. It's interesting, isn't it? At home, you probably. I, I kind of feel like I want to have eggs and bacon and real old English. And out on the road you have something like, like porridge, which I have at home. Just give me the taste for it. Um, yeah, so yeah, that and then sort out bits and pieces for uh, the funeral clothing wise. Anyway, peace my brothers and sisters and uh, we'll speak later.